day two. Today's video is gonna be all about cleaning my instrument. I haven't really talked about that, how to properly clean it after playing for a while. I think this is very important for proper hygiene and for the instrument's health and most of all for my own health. <laughs> Before I even picked out the instrument, I, I had already ordered a cleaning toolkit. It basically contains a couple of those microfiber wipes, and yes, I chose it because I like the color. It should be fun, right? A little brush, a toothbrush for, you know. No, this is also for the instrument. Most importantly, it came with two of these. Oh, this one goes into the bell, and this is for the neck and the mouthpiece. I'm gonna play some notes now for some practice, and then I'm gonna show you how I've been cleaning it. <laughs> today considering that I haven't had a lesson yet by the way my very first saxophone lesson with the teacher is scheduled for tomorrow next up cleaning first of all I'm going to take the instrument off of the harness very gently take out the mouthpiece and start with cleaning that and carefully take the reed off I've had this in my mouth. So what I like to do is I go wash it off with some tap water. <sighs> All right, so I give this reed a good rinse and I just wipe it down nice and clean. And I kept those plastic containers, or however you would call that little case, um, that the reed came in. So I just slide it back in. This is not airtight, so that's good. It can breathe, it can dry out. And I put it into this bag with my other reeds that I haven't used in this session but earlier today. And along with the reeds, there's no mess, no worries, enjoy. Two-way humidity control pack. And that's supposed to keep them fresh because the worst thing that could happen is that all the germs would be multiplying. And I don't want mold on my reeds. And then the mouthpiece, I'm gonna wipe that down too. I take the smaller one of these and pull it through like that. Can you see that? And there we go. Da -da -da -da. Chaos behind me. This is not a professional production. <laughs> so what you're seeing back there on the floor is the charger for my very old uh, Windows PC from 2007, 8, 9. That I've just recently reactivated to be able to play some online computer games. So once this is done, I grab my neck, wipe that down, and then I do the same thing. I grab the same small one of the wipes. I try to be as gentle as possible, <laughs> I promise. There's a weight in here. Gravity. Gravity does the job. And you just pull through. There's no such thing as too clean in my world. Back into the case. That. Try to hold it by the bell I'm somewhere where I don't press down on any keys. The thinner end goes in first into the bell, nice and straight as it goes in. So I just lift it up, wiggle it around a little bit until I can see it coming out. Oh, there it is. Pull, 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 pull. There we go. And I'll do that again. I pull, I pull, I pull. So I've done this a couple times and now I can put away the instrument. I think if I do this every time, I will have a long, happy life with this instrument. At some point, I will definitely put these in the wash. And that's it for today. That was fun. <laughs> Day number two, I would say I'm pretty happy with the progress. Nothing hurts so far. Um, today I was watching some YouTube videos on the right posture and how to hold the instrument right to avoid any, any strain, any pain in my fingers or my neck, worst of all, shoulders, etc. Stay hydrated, kids. If you happen to randomly land on my channel and see this video and you think oh, she's doing everything wrong and you have any recommendations on how I could improve my cleaning process, 
I would really, really appreciate that. So feel free to leave a comment and I will try to implement any tips and tricks, any cleaning hacks. As you can imagine, I am super excited and very much looking forward to my first lesson tomorrow. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun and I'm looking forward to sharing what I've learned. Stay with me if you're curious too. And thank you so much for watching. See you.